Next topic here that I wanted to hit, Quinn Ewers. Leaving Ohio State after one season, he he basically redshirted, didn't see the field at all. He's the $1 million man, left his high school in Texas a year early to go and collect them checks, and I cannot fault him for that. But he didn't play this season, and apparently, from what I have been told, because I, I tweeted this out on Friday and was like, what is going on in this sport right now? This Everything is bananas. And I had multiple DMs from people that said, yo, this has actually been going on since like October. He got homesick. And I'm like, well, yeah, that makes sense because he's a friggin' child. Like he's 17 yeah. years old. What are we talking oh, no, about? No, he was, he was but, the same age as a normal high school kid. Yeah, he's a high school kid. College. He was the same age as a normal college freshman. That's it. right, but he, oh, that's right. He's eighteen. That's right because he was he, held back. Yes, he's the exact same Either age. Way. Of, which hell, which that still happens. By the way, my yes. first freshman year of college, I went away with no friends. Went to a school where I didn't know a soul, and and yeah, I, I struggled my first year a lot. I struggled a whole lot. But it, now apparently he is going back to Texas, and it is between yeah. Texas Tech, which whoa, Joey McGuire, what are you doing? And Zero then, chance he's going to Texas Tech. So, I, I've Zero had people chance, tell me... the number one quarterback in the country it, it, and from that class is going to Texas Tech. I would not say never on that. Okay. But we'll see. I'll say never. The other names, by the way, are That's Texas... Because you won't ever put yourself out there. You, Texas you, and you Texas just want everything. Yeah, you just do nothing but take chalk. So, <laughs> that's fine. This is not chalk. I think there is a very, very strong possibility that he goes to Texas Tech. Joey McGuire is so tied in down there, and he sees what's going on at Texas, and he sees what Texas A&M just went through. Uh, like, yes, Jimbo is one thing, and you got a bunch of star players to play around with. I just, I wonder what, the, I don't I don't know what this kid is, right? I don't know what he, he went to Ohio State. That's the place that you're supposed to go and, like, work your way up. You can be a Heisman guy there. You can da 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 I, I just wonder, like, is he somebody that would prefer the small town life and Lubbock would fit, Right. <laughs> there's there's just that's not <clears throat> i just don't think it's gonna happen it it may not but but we'll see thanks for listening to the winning cures everything podcast the website is winning cures everything.com and if you want to connect with us we're on twitter at gary wce at chris b giannini at winning cures or you can email us gary at winning cures everything.com or chris at winning cures everything.com subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe and we'll see you soon